Hey guys, I'm back with another speed test comparison and in this video we'll be comparing the OnePlus 3T running the Android 7.0 Nougat versus the Google Pixel XL which is on the Android 7.1.1. So uh, first off, we're going to be starting this test with the uh, boot up comparison. So here we go. And both phones of course have Snapdragon 821 processor. Uh, we do get 6 gigs of RAM on the uh, OnePlus 3T, which is, of course, more than the four gigs of RAM that we get on the Pixel XL. So let's see which will be faster in booting up. Okay, OnePlus 3T beats the Pixel when it comes to booting up with the latest Android 7.0 Nougat. And Pixel XL is still taking some time. Okay, there is the sound and now it is also done. So you can see that the OnePlus 3T, the best thing that I like about its software that is that it's uh, close to stock, uh, which is nice. You can see the app drawer. And if we go into the main settings, look at that. They look so much similar i mean with the latest 7.0 you get the settings they are looking very similar to the pixel settings you can see android 7.1.1 versus android 7.0 here so same wi-fi network on both devices i'm going to start off this test uh with the very basic phone dialer in three two one go so i think that was a about the same, maybe the OnePlus 3T was a bit quicker. Again, you guys are the judge here. And uh, let's go back and try out something like Calculator, which we do have on both phones. Okay, go. And that felt pretty much the same. Uh, no difference when it comes to system-based applications. You can see that. A uh, little bit difference maybe because of animations. We can go and check the Subway Surfer. So let's launch some third-party applications side by side. Let's go and see which is going to be faster. So 1 plus 3T. Okay, 3T is faster followed by the Pixel XL WhatsApp and I think that was faster on the uh, Pixel XL a little bit let's check Viber okay about the same let's uh, launch the uh, color switch let's go that was about the same next we got Twitter Again, pretty similar. Let's check out Instagram. Okay, uh, one, uh, one plus three T was a bit behind. Pixel XL loaded the latest feed like super quick. Like I, I didn't saw that uh, refresh sign at all. So super good performance here on both devices. They're pretty much neck and neck. Uh, let's launch another game that is Smash Hit. Go and you can see one plus 3t is faster there let's go back and quickly launch gunfu stickman go gain faster on the one plus 3t so um uh, really i mean uh, the differences of course are really close uh, but i do have to say that one plus 3t uh, does have improvement over the marshmallow, you know, I never actually did the speed test on marshmallow uh, But what but I've seen on other other videos that uh, it ju is just Performs faster with the nougat, you know, I, I can feel the improvement here uh, With the the overall software so pixel XL definitely uh, one of the best and fastest phones to get uh, and with the latest 7.1.1, which is even better, you get the uh, the shortcuts here, which we don't get on the normal 7.0. So lastly, we'll be checking out camera on both phones. Here we go. And I think it was faster on the OnePlus 3T. So 
Again, uh, OnePlus 3T definitely provides improvement. Like I said, uh, we can move on and uh, check out the browsing performance on both phones. So I'm going to be using Google Chrome on both of these two devices. Okay, so first website will be Facebook.com. And let's see here. Both phones are on the website. And the Pixel XL wins. Okay, Pixel XL faster with the first website. Let's uh, quickly go back and launch youtube.com okay hmm again google pixel xl is definitely faster uh with this website also uh, we also have wikipedia.org third website and let's see here again pixel xl win so clean win uh for the pixel when it comes to browsing uh, again, uh, both phones were, you know, really fast. Obviously, comparison-wise, Pixel wins. We go into the multitasking and see if there's any kind of uh, refresh uh, or not. So, uh, calculator kept in the memory. Oops. Calculator. Everything is in the memory on both phones. We got uh, Subway Surfer. Okay, no refresh at all. And really, I mean, whichever phone you get, you're going to get top-notch performance. You know, no lag, smooth experience. Especially, I've heard a lot about the Pixel. I mean, the experience of the pure Android is just so great. So, let's see here. Viber. But, I mean, you don't really have to spend that much money on Pixel just for performance. Because you can pretty much get the same performance on the OnePlus 3T. Uh, okay, is, was that a refresh? That was actually weird. I don't know if that was a refresh. Okay. I don't really see a white screen on the 3T like I saw on the uh, Pixel XL. Let's see here if we launch Smash it. Okay, so it is actually refreshing the application. I cannot believe this. Oh my god. Oh my god. This is the Pixel XL that we are talking about. I mean, people are just crazy about this phone when it comes to performance. And it is refreshing applications on 7.1.1. I can't believe this. I can't believe this. Oh my god. This is shocking. OnePlus 3D just kills the Pixel when it comes to multitasking. And to be really honest, multitasking is like my favorite part in a speed test comparison. I mean, not all applications are refreshed here, but really it's, it's a shame. I mean, you have to pay like almost $1,000 where I live for the Pixel XL. Uh, I mean, it's crazy that uh, I'm just disappointed, you know. Uh, so this just really tells like if you want the performance, you know, best performance, you don't have to spend that much money. Uh, for the Pixel, you can get the same, much cheaper, almost half the price uh, with the OnePlus 3 d And the software also looks a lot like stock. And I mean, it may not be the uh, having the best camera like the Pixel has, which is obviously something really great. But really, I mean, performance-wise, uh, there is no difference. Even right now, as as according to this speed test, the OnePlus 3 d is actually better than the Pixel XL. So. Yeah, let me know your thoughts. I would love to hear uh, your thoughts about uh, this uh, speed test. I will be doing like a comparison of the Pixel uh, with other devices also and see if uh, this happened in other tests also or not. Or, uh, you know, maybe it might be like a occasional, occasional, um, you know, refresh in the multitasking area, maybe. But yeah, thank you so much for watching this video. Please subscribe if you haven't. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.